Okay, I'm using the Arduino Pro Micro or the Arduino Leonardo because I bought this from eBay. It doesn't have the SparkFun Pro Micro software or a firmware in it. And I'll just plug it in. It works. And you can see here our uh, wires attached to the RX1 and TX1 of the new Pro Micro. And I attach that to the FTDI chip that's connected to my computer. Uh, the RX is connected to TX and the TX is connected to the RX and as you can see I run the, I ran the program of the SparkFun Blink, Blink software it just blinks the RX0 and TX0, RX LED and TX LED uh, alternately each having a, a second duration one second duration for each and as one cycle progresses it outputs a hello world to the port, um, the COM port that it communicates with the USB and a hello to the UART, the other UART that goes to the FTDI chip. Now, if you want to see the code, I place the code here. This is the Blink software for my Arduino Pro Micro. As you can see, there are uh, two serial begins, serial nothing and serial one. Serial one is the external uh, serial, which is the external UART that's connected to the FD, FTDI chip. The serial is communicating to the onboard USB or the USB itself. Um, as you can see, if I click tools, oops, I, I set my board to Arduino Leonardo, and if I set my COM port to COM14 or the Arduino Leonardo, and if I switch and I can view the serial monitor in it. You can see a hello world displaying. If I switch to my FTDI, FTDI chip, if I switch to the COM port to the COM12, I know that's COM12. I check it beforehand, and if I click the serial monitor, monitor, you can see only hello. Well, that's because of the program that uh, prints the data hello to serial 1 or the external UART or the external uh, FDI chip and the serial did nothing it just prints hello world to the onboard USB communications and uh, let's tell you it works because I'm just skeptical if it doesn't work because there's black marks on the pins of the RX and the grounds of my Arduino Pro Micro and I would just like to test that out by using this simple software and simple FTDI chip. Uh, it's just connected to the RX and TX of it. Just sending data. Nothing much. And uh, thank you for watching. Please subscribe.